The latest now on a story we've been tracking since early this morning. The cleanup continues after a massive fire involving a half dozen boats at the Rhode Island Yacht Club in Cranston. And while some were sleeping on their boats, the flames quickly spread late Saturday night. And we're learning more about the dramatic rescue as two people were trapped on their fiery boats. Quick and without warning, the flames spread across six boats at the Rhode Island Yacht Club in Cranston late Saturday night. Some people were woken up by other members, so hats off to them for saving lives. When fire crews arrived, the deputy chief described it as a wall of flames. And fireboats from Cranston and Warwick had to get around that wall to rescue two people. People were trapped on their boats and couldn't cross the dock. And so they were, um, you know, put them on the boats and brought them to shore. Some members heard about the scene overnight, but then went to the Yacht Club Sunday to see the damage firsthand. It was pretty horrific, and then to see the boats today the way they are, to think nobody got hurt, we're very, very fortunate. DEM put booms in place so workers could clean up the oil and gasoline that leaked into the water. The damage is estimated at well over a million dollars, but the fact no one was hurt is priceless. We're glad things worked out the way it did. You can always replace property. With the summer boating season right around the corner, the Yacht Club is planning to rebuild. This club will be up and running in no time. Now the Chris and Fire Marshal tells us the city decided to turn the boats over to the insurance company. Once the boats are pulled out of the water in the next day or two, the company will bring in experts and engineers to try to determine a cause of the fire.